I think the last thing that we want to argue is how to hold back innovation. Even the doctor who is maybe at risk tomorrow to be exposed because 80% of his analytics can be done through technology. Maybe exactly the same doctor is benefiting from the technology who is predicting some kind of disease he could have, which he would not see if we wouldn't use technologies. If you think about today on the capacity of um, artificial intelligence in the healthcare system, I think we are running not, nothing short than an effective healthcare system in most countries I know, which is affordable and which is giving access to all people in a country and not only the ones who can afford it. So if predictive technology gives everybody a chance to have a better healthcare system, I think then we should as a society have that discussion and take the opportunity at the same time, I know that in my industry, and so I think in many other industries, at, as we speak, there are people needed, which are great in having an industry expertise as much as understanding how to read data. I'm pretty sure we would find for a lot of doctors, to stay in that example, good ways to actually know their, their domain expertise and multiply it and combine it with some great analytic skills to be even more pointed and effective on, on healthcare systems.